Hello, happy Monday. Uh, don't forget, drop me a like in down below. I'd appreciate that very much. I always do, so drop a like in, double tap, whatever you need to do, that's great. Drop us a comment in as well, smiley face, thumbs up. Uh, let me know how you're doing today as well. That's also awesome, uh, much appreciated. I hope everyone's good this Monday. Uh, don't forget as well, if you want to get involved in uh, online virtual bootcamp sessions, um, our six week uh, transformation program for women only. All you need to do is comment below with ready uh, and I'll or send me a message and we can have a chat and see if we can help. We've got a very special offer, on, a very, very special offer at the moment uh, where you can get involved with our online sessions prior to joining the six week program. Um, and if you want to get involved in that, it's particularly concerned about weight gain over the next few weeks, just comment again below with ready and we'll send you the details. Right, so let's talk about little fires everywhere. So there's a fantastic, I love me telly, uh, so I've been self-employed for 11 years and many, many years ago I was, I was one of those people who like, you know, was up for the grind and all that sort of stuff and I um, I thought that watching telly was bad, but actually, if, I think if you, you can manage your time well and you work hard, um, there's nothing wrong with having a bit of downtime watching some telly because there's some, some fantastic stuff on, um, particularly on Netflix and Prime, which are my two favourite things. So but on Prime Video, a show called Little Fires Anyway is a fantastic show to watch. Very insightful, very poignant, uh, very relevant as well. There's some very relevant topics on there, even though it's a book from quite a while ago, I think, based on a book from quite a while ago. And basically, you've got two magic, two main characters, one of which is played by Reese Witherspoon. Um, the other lad is Kerry Washington. You might not have heard of her, but you, I would assume you've heard of uh, Reese Witherspoon. And basically, I won't spoil it for you, but basically, there's two characters, and you're trying to decide <laughs> which one's the, cause of the classic situation of good and bad, and you're trying to decide is there a good and a bad guy here uh, in this situation. And it's quite blurred in terms of how it works. And it, it, it's a really, really good show. Uh, there's some great subject matters tackled in it, um, which is it, well worth a watch. Uh, so, little fires everywhere. Now, the, the, as you can guess, obviously, Little Fires Everywhere is a metaphor. Um, and it's Little Fires Everywhere is a metaphor for little things that happen that then cause big issues. OK, so and it's the same on this program as well. Um, and I think sometimes we we often forget that it's the little things that add up that make a difference. Now, I've been overweight. I've been five stone heavier than I am now. You know my story, hopefully. Um, and someone, when someone asks me, like my wife will say, well, how do people get really, really big? And I'll say, well, when I was really, really big, it was denial. It was ignoring those little warning signs along the way, which eventually led to the bigger problem. So I'd ask you that question. What are you ignoring? What little things are you ignoring that could potentially be a problem down the line? A couple of examples. You could put on two pound a month right, in weight, and you probably wouldn't notice that until it got to a year. That's a stone and a half, 24 pounds, more than a stone and a half, 24 pounds in weight. Yeah, that's quite significant change. But you wouldn't notice two pound a month, but you would notice 24 pounds. It's the same with workouts. You miss a workout, you miss one workout, not really a problem. But the, when you miss one, then you're more likely to miss two. Miss two, then three, then four, then five, then six, then months, then years, and then you're having a conversation with somebody like myself saying, well, I used to be, I used to do this, I used to do that. And I think particularly on that respect, what you've got to remember is there's a difference between physically not being able to do something. Like if, if I'm looking after my 17-month-old son and somebody says, can you come and do something without him? I can't, can I? I can't physically do that. But a lot of people choose not to do something. They make a choice and then say they couldn't when actually it was a choice. Um, so, for example, with our virtual boot camps, we do virtual boot camps at the same time. If somebody is able to do it and they choose not to, it's a choice. So, basically, um, that then contributes to these little fires, which then become big fires. Um, and you have to be aware of that, because I promise you, from somebody that's been obese and unhealthy, it all comes down to little decisions. It doesn't just happen overnight. Tony Robbins says success doesn't just show up and neither does failure. It's little things that, that happen over time that make the biggest differences. So you've got to identify those little things. It's like now, um, Christmas is coming, uh, those little chocolates you get, celebrations for example, or miniature heroes, 50 calories a pop, one, fine, 10, problem. But 10 across a day, when you don't notice, you keep going back to the, the tin, that's 500 calories. And for most women who we work with, that's probably about a third to a quarter of their daily calorie intake in chocolates that won't fill you up. So you have to watch those little fires, you have to watch the little things, because um, they add up. You know, most people put on seven to 10 pounds over Christmas. If you add on this year to that, and don't do anything about it, you're gonna have problems. You can't keep 
letting little things go. You can't keep missing the little things because eventually they will become the big things. Remember that. So uh, yeah, little fires everywhere. Watch it, but remember, check your own little fires. It's important. So yeah, any thoughts or comments on that, let me know below. Appreciate that as always. Drop me a thumbs up, smiley face. Uh, let me know how you're doing. Let me know if you disagree with me. I always love a bit of intelligent debate. Double tap or click like. Appreciate that as well. Share the videos. Fantastic if you can do that for me as well. And again, if you do want any details on our Women Only Group Fitness Program for women over 30, uh, we've got a very special offer on at the moment if you want to join us now for our online sessions leading into our physical sessions on the back, hopefully soon. Just comment below with ready or send me a message and we can have a chat and see if we can help. Have a good day.